Why is he so extra? <laughs> Hi, <laughs> Missouri. Class of 2020. <laughs> My name is Shannon High, and I'm ready to be your junior class president. Now, I think we all know that our school isn't quite perfect. No school is perfect, and we can't expect our school to be perfect, but I got some improvements that will make our school pretty darn close to perfect, let me tell you. Yeah. Now, now, I think it's pretty well known that our school has a bit of an insect problem, um, particular approaches. Yeah. yeah, so we need to take care of this, right? Yeah. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the solution, folks, it's really quite simple, is we have to come up with something that's more terrifying than the cockroach. We have to find something that's just, that really gets you more scared overall. So, <laughs> now, unfortunately, I only have a prototype with me today, but introducing the canoodle bug. <laughs> it has the face of yours truly, Mr. Knudsen. <laughs> and lucky for you guys, I have some for everyone right now. So here we go. Oh. <laughs> 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 oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, that's scary. Wait, I wanna see, I wanna see, I wanna see, I wanna see. I'm crying. It's so Bruh. This is a joke. They just have to see a few of those bad boys, a little cockroach encounter will be like a walk in the park, you know? Now, who thinks that our lunchtime is just too short? I mean, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. We, we need a longer lunch period. You barely have time to go get food, come back to school, and then you can't even take your food to your next class, right? So, yeah. So if our lunchtime doesn't get increased, I think the only way for us to get back in time is the speed, you know? You can't drive the speed and then get back, yeah. So, yeah, yeah, I like that! So, administration is going to have to pay for all that until our lunchtime gets increased. Yeah, all right, that, that's a little crazy, that's a little crazy. But I have a way to pay for those, you know. But I had a hard time coming up with a way to get that money because you guys are pretty terrible drivers. So I've gotten a three car. I, <laughs> I was thinking we're gonna make our own currency of goops off in high school. Oh my god, I love this. Something you can print right out of the library printer. Yeah. Now obviously I know that I mean I didn't have to take economics to know that that won't be too valuable for us. So we had to make this you know, currency something valuable, something, someone's face that can represent something. The power of Kubasaka. Yeah. So I was thinking, Milanovic medallions? Yeah. I don't know, this may be a bit of a stretch. Or how about Mr. Koya coins? Oh. Was, okay, or how about Miss Vincent's V-Bucks? Oh yeah! Oh, okay. <laughs> It hit me. It hit me. I was so No, this is so funny. Stop this. Time. So I'm, I'm going to need a volunteer from the crowd. Hey! Guys. Break the crowd! Oh my God. That's oh, rude! Right. No, 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 this is hilarious. This is hilarious. Victoria. Victoria, what's your name? She's as big as me. Are you excited to get uh, to check out the new currency of Goop Sock, guys? <laughs> Introducing Mao Yen. Like Mao Yen, but Mao Yen. And it has the face of Dr. Mao Yen on every single one. And Victoria, you get to see him first. I'm like, no, you want some, right? Well, well it's your lucky day because I have some for everyone else, too. Now the really good ones have a, uh, there's the common Mr. 
I mean, Dr. Mowen, and then there's someone, Mr. Clean.